Hello everyone watching on YouTube and welcome back to more Digimon World 2. I hit continue game for no reason. We have to load a save state, which I think is done by F3. Ah, hello. Is this where we left off? I'm fighting Bertran, right? Pretty sure. Hey, get fire blasted. We're just right into the action today. Not really a lot of choice in the matter. Get this Vegemon out of my face and then you got a Thunderball. Yeah, we're at the end of a dungeon or whatever, and Bertrand is a piece of garbage. So we have to fight him before we can fight uh, the Blood Knight or whatever right after, I think, is what we're doing. That sounds about right. And then we have to buy a bunch of missiles to go through the other dungeon, because the other dungeon is stupid. Easy damage. I'm gonna be honest, I thought that Gabumon would just die. I thought he would be dead as heck. How dare you branch drain my wizard? You're gonna get thunderballed for that. Which is probably gonna take away all the health you just got from using branch drain and not much else. Thunder cloud. I did a little bit more. This is the slowest Garburumon in history. Yo, Howling Blaster's animation is pretty clean. Oh, dude, that is really sick. Animations in this game are so good for the time. It's definitely, like, the best thing the game has going for it. How dare you hit my tree. That tree was mine. You think this Vegemon is gonna die to this Fire Blast? I doubt it, but I'm gonna let... I'm gonna let fate decide. My red vegetable is far superior to your vegetable. Garurum on Vaxxin in this game? Oh, it did die. Nice. I'm a genius. I did so little to the Garurum on. Hey, it still did like over 20. It's probably more so that Vegemon just sucks. If you and your friends were in Digimon, what partners do you think you and your friends would have? Oh, I have no idea what the other losers I talk with would have. I would hope to have a Doramon, though. None of my other friends really like or interact with Digimon all that much. Lone Wolf kind of does. None of the others do. Thunder Cloud! Big damage, big damage. Micho, welcome to stream. How's it going? How goes Digimon World 2? Uh, it, it's happening. <laughs> sometimes fine, sometimes unacceptable. Hey, be dead. Man, Bertrand, if only you could have just not wasted your and my time by being a buffoon. There was no need for us to go through all this. Ah, oh, the classic paralysis insecured. Oh no, my vegetable. I needed that. All right, Garurumon is definitely vaccinated. Isn't it like Gabumon is data and Metal Garurumon is data, but then for some reason Garurumon and where Garurumon are Vaxxin? I think that's how it is in Cyber Sleuth, at least. No matter what, it's whack. Alright, well. Whoops. All that's left is- how did I accidentally leave this Gabumon alive for last? How did that happen? I better get a lot of experience for this. I probably won't, but I want it. Kind of like Patamon going from Data to Vaxxin. Yeah, but when Patamon digivolves to Angemon, he then stays Vaxxin forever. It's kind of weird that Gabumon is Data, then Vaxxin, then goes back to, uh, to Data. All right, cool. What is Rogue Condor's level cap again? It's like 22, right? I don't know about you. Jim Falcon, I think, just hit his level cap.
Why? I can't believe that I lost to a rookie like you. You suck! What did I do wrong? There's no way I could lose. Why? Oh, yeah. That's right. I went easy on you, but just this time. Next time won't be so easy. You are... It's amazing how much of a moron you are. It must be hard being so stupid all the time. I almost feel sorry for you. All right. Jim Falcon should be at his level cap now, which is pretty sick. So we should put in... Uh, we shouldn't put... We should put in Zavid, the Devadramon, because we want him to level up. We don't care about this new Mamon. I'm, it's a sacrifice for a dragon. So give me Rogue Condor, who just leveled up, which is perfect for this upcoming fight. And then give me Zavid, and then give me this Wizardmon. My Wizardmon doesn't have a nickname, which honestly I prefer. I'm realizing now, by the way, that every single time your Digimon, uh, well, maybe not when they Digivolve, but whenever your Digimon DNA Digivolves, you just get to rename it. So I probably shouldn't have even bothered nicknaming Digimon, although naming them the whole Tony Hawk saga has been pretty funny. Yo, your Digibeetle looks so much cooler than mine. But I guess when they Digivolve, you probably don't get to change their names, I don't remember. Which would have been annoying. Hey you! Yes you! What happened to the tamer? I'm that guard tamer! Prepare to be destroyed! Ha 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 ha! You make me laugh! Look at this guy's mustache! Do you really think you can beat me, Commander Damien? The Dawn of the Blood Knights? The Dawn? I'll make you an example for those stupid tamers of the city. I am invincible. Are you really a high-ranking officer of the Blood Knights? Oh, well, fine then. Don't answer my question. I like keeping three originals and use the rest to feed them. I mean, yeah, it's kind of what I do, too. I'm really only keeping two Digimon, and I'm feeding everything else into them right now. Yo, that's a Warumanzimon and a Platinum Sukumon? Plat is Plat I always forget. Is Platinum Sukumon champion or ultimate? He's ultimate, right? Because Sukumon is a champion? Yo, Devadramon's sprite is so good. Devadramon is defaulted level 12. I wonder if that means he'll make it to level 20. It would be so amazing if Devadramon has a level cap of 20 because that means he'll be worth uh, four more to the level cap. Uh, excuse me? Are you telling me that Crimson Claw is capable of confusion, poising, and, and stunning? That's madness. Well, I mean, I'm not going to Friendly Fire, so I'm going to Crimson Claw, I guess. So, like, the War Romanzimon is scary, but I feel like I want to kill the weaker ones first to make it easier to deal with the War Romanzimon. These all look like viruses as well, which is highly unfortunate. I'm a little worried because, you know, this is Devadramon's first time being in a fight. He's, you know, not going to be super strong, theoretically. But we do have Fire Blasting Red Vegemon, which is a good sign. Ooh, you're quick. Party time? Oh, well, if you're going to use garbage moves like that, we should be fine. I only did 22. How does the number 22 come up so often? Panic Wave? This sounds annoying. Gained Confusion Power? Oh, so now you can inflict Confusion. All right, yeah, that really blows. I hate that. I love that animation, though. Oh, there's the damage I'm looking for. Where are my three status effects? Give me some of those status effects, cowards. We definitely want to kill the Platinum Sukumon. The good news is it looks like these other failures might just spam party time, which is a garbage move. I mean, it's doing some damage, but still. We do also, we have friendly fire on Devadramon, and I think we have friendly fire on... Uh, on Rogue Condor, so like we would be hurting our own dudes to do it, but we could unconfuse our people as needed. It's not even took a lot of damage. Now I still just want to focus the Platinum Sukumon and get him out of here. Should I heal? Nah. Might have to do a heal on the next one. I, don't e I have an HP driver, don't I? I don't even remember. All that really matters right now is not missing Fire Blast. As long as we keep hitting this, we'll be fine. I did trade for this Wizardmon. Oh, he lost his Confusion thing. What a loser. Heartbreak hit. Oh, no. What is this? Attack and defense down? Does that do attack and defense down for literally everyone? 
Kind of seems like it defeats the purpose if it just removes attack and defense on literally everyone. Oh, come on, dude. I need you to hit those. Ow, my wizard. I wish I hadn't missed that Crimson Claw right now. That would have been really helpful. It targets all, but it's RNG if it works on any. Oh, so it only worked on, I think, Wizardmon, and it didn't do anything to anyone else? All right. That's not too bad, then. Also seems like a really stupid move. Wait a minute. My Wizardmon is low on HP. I want him to get this experience at the end of this. Do I not have an... Okay, I do have... I was about to say, I thought I had an HP driver, too. I do. We need to start getting... I need the game to start letting me buy as if I ever have any money that I don't immediately have to spend on, like, either uh, gifts or random upgrades to my stuff. But uh, I need the game to start letting me buy level 2 HP discs. Oh, no, that ability only hits data, Digimon? That's super whack. So it only affects Wizardmon. That's crazy. What a bad move. <laughs> I really want to kill this Platinum Sukumon before it starts confusing us. Because so far it has not done that. All it does every turn is give the confusion ability to people. Please, just keep giving it to yourself, you dumb idiot. You're not attacking anyway. And then this, oh, all this does is lower the attack and defense of Wizardmon specifically? Okay. Okay. Dude, this guy was talking such smack, and he's garbage. This guy sucks at his job. This is one of the most garbage fights I've had so far. Garbage is in, this guy sucks. Not garbage is in, like, the game is being annoying. Dude, when Crimson Claw hits, it's so good. I want to catch more Devadramon and just give everyone Crimson Claw. Oh, no! My giant death dragon! Also, Devadramon just looks amazing. I love this Digimon. You don't see Devadramon super often in Digimon games or in the anime, really, for that matter. Oh, nice seven damage. He does suck, but did you see his sick mustache? You know, you got a good point there. I think everything except the Waru Monzimon is going to die to this uh, Fire Blast. Fire Blast. Come on, give me two kills here. Two kills here. The Nanimon is definitely dead. Yeah, let's go. And then this idiot just keeps using a Heartbreak attack. This is easy as heck. Chaos, would you grow facial hair like that? Absolutely not. Also, I was not given the genetics to grow facial hair, unfortunately. Oh, to be honest, I don't think I'd want facial hair. It would be nice to not have to shave as often, I guess, but it does sound like it would be annoying to have to deal with the upkeep of it. Also, I feel like my face would just always feel itchy. Does Crimson Claw have low accuracy, chat? I feel like he keeps missing a lot. Well, it's I think it's missed like half. I've hit like two and missed two. Milf lover 169 what a name welcome to stream is this gonna be the final stream of the game I don't know that's totally up to the game to be honest this war Monzimon is an idiot he's actually a buffoon Devadramon is just blind but he has four eyes How can you be blind when you have four eyes? That's madness. Oh, this war reminds me of is way lar- My controller stopped working? We're seriously doing it? What is wrong with this emulator? And by that, I mean my legit- Hold up, we gotta save state. Make sure it actually saved. It did. Gotta close and reopen it. I don't remember having this. I used the same emulator for, um... For Digimon World 1 and 3. I don't remember it having this problem. 
Not that I can recall. Come on, load back up. It had the problem in World 1? It did? I don't remember that. At least it's an easy fix. Alright, this should do it, as long as we don't miss. Devadramon, please don't miss. Kill this fool with the Crimson Claw. Also, note to self, War Monzimon is hot trash in this video game. It has one of the worst attacking moves, and then his support move only affects data, Digimon. I mean, it's pretty sick when it does affect them, but if you're not fighting data Digimon, it's literally worthless. If you're only fighting one data Digimon, it seems worthless. You seriously live that? Are you kidding me right now? Oh, I get him. The unexpected Wizardmon kill? With that big seven damage? My boy Wizardmon coming in clutch. Oh, wait, I'm on the wrong. Sorry. Whoop. You might have seen a little black bar at the bottom of the screen there. I was on the wrong screen region. Yo, over 400 experience. Let's get it. 2,500 bits. Now that's what I'm talking about. I need more of that, please. That's another weird thing with this emulator. It puts a little black bar at the very bottom of it. Something is wrong. How could I lose? Did you see your strategy? You're a moron. Aren't you a bit weak for a boss? Be quiet, you brat. I'll let you off this time. But the next time we meet, I will finish you off. Until then, train hard. Okay. What? Wait, where are you going? Is he really a high-ranking officer? What's that? There's something red on the floor. This is an order to search for the archive ship. It is possible. I got the red orders. What the, what the heck is the archive ship? What does that even mean? Well, we got that done pretty, pretty quick there. Not bad. Now we've got to get some of those stupid missiles to go through the next thing. Because that the next dungeon is stupid. And beat the Blood Knight there. Bum, 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 bum. Alright. Let's, uh... We should go do some DNA Digivolving first. Tony Hawk Jr. is finally going to get to fuse with his Woodmon. Hi. Hi. I hope it's not just going to give me another mushroom. I also still hate this guy having to check my identification every single time. Can you please die? Oh, yeah, we also have to trade that new Mamon. Right, right, right. And then we'll have a Mega Dramon. We'll have our first ultimate by trading. Classic. Why work for your ultimate level Digimon when you can just trade a literal piece of garbage for one? Alright, so I want to fuse Tony Hawk Jr., who's level 15, with Jim Falcon, who is at his max level of 19. And it's going to give me a go another Goblimon, which is fun. Uh, yeah? Yeah. This is right. Pretty sure. They had to think for a second there. It's like, do, do we really want to do this? Do we really want to meld our bodies into one? Hey. Sorry, I had to look at something on my phone really quickly. Uh, this is Tony Hogg Jr., right? Pretty certain. Whoops. Tony... H-mon. <laughs> Tony Hawk... Junior. Easy. Alright, not bad, not bad. Got him. Uh, I think this thing level caps at 19 as well. So we kind of honestly, like... If it level caps at 19 and we're gonna use it to DNA Digivolve to give someone more... Like a higher level cap, 
it's not really worth DNA digivolving him, like getting him to level 19 first, assuming the other Digimon he DNA digivolves with is going to be higher level. I don't know. I think that's right. I don't want to DNA digivolve him with Wizardmon because that's going to turn him into a virus. I want to keep a champion. I don't want to have like an all virus squad. And the fact that we have mostly viruses means having a data is really nice. We need to catch another data Digimon to fuse with Wizardmon when we get a moment. We should really get on that. Let's see. Before we do anything else, let's go trade this new Mamon out. 